it is time for another patches update because I got six of them right here for today. Hey guys, what's going on today here? This is Ruroni K95 here. Once again, we're going to be doing my brand new patch update because I got six of these patches that I had right here from my previous patches unboxing video I did a while back as well. I got six of those right here as well. And those are the extra patches I got as well, which I'm planning to start a new battle jacket once I get another one as well. Yeah, it's this one I'm just going to show you. A little, ma little magic touch I did as well. I'm going to show you in the video as well. Just for the second as well. Okay. These are the patches right here. Which, this is going to help me devote... I have here, because I got extra of those as well, because mostly are me rock and metal patches on here. And that's going to help me start a brand new battle jacket as well, because I just have a feeling, though, is that I'm starting another battle jacket as well. And, as you guys all know, I have been literally getting into this other website. Before we, before we dive into six of these patches that I got here as well, I'm going to start a, in this video, just to get, in case you all doesn't know, there has been an ongoing priority planning that I found this website called tshirtslayer.com where you could trade in your patches or your shirts of your favorite band on here like if you can trade it in as well like you want to sell it as well let's say for example like I want to trade in a patch as well like for example like I have my chemical romance patch this is the kind you want to trade this in on tshirtslayer.com because I have a good proper feeling of how I wanted to check out tshirtslayer.com as well. And that just shows that, and obviously though is that I have heard interesting things about this website called tshirtslayer.com because I thought of something new because I just wanted to check this website out called tshirtslayer.com. Yeah. And obviously, though, I just wanted to check it out because tshirtslayer.com is very new as well. Yeah, they got like a bunch of patches on here, like if you want to buy them as well. Because I highly recommend you, like, if you want to look for a loudness patch or any metal patches on here. Yeah, you could find them on uh, tshirtslayer.com. Or if you want to look for some lots of patches that you wanted for your battle jacket, I guess you can go to tshirtslayer.com because I highly recommend you to check it. You know, because the they're a buy buy sell trade group web page on there because if you, especially if you want to look for a good patches you want, once and you trade in patches on tshirtslayer.com, you got is. My Chemical Romance Patch, which is... It's going to go to tshirtslayer.com as well. Because I'm going to have to trade that in for a Burzum Patch or Mayhem Patch. Because I'm literally getting into Norwegian black metal bands on here. That's why. And that just shows... And obviously that just shows that I'm going to get into... Yeah, I wanted to get some more patches so I could start to finish off on my first primary battle jacket and if I have more of them I will start a new battle jacket and if I get another back patch and this time it's gonna be Iron Maiden Killers back patch which that'll be for the next battle jacket that I plan as well so yeah and obviously because that's how I wanted to come by on starting a new battle jacket to plan so, speaking of which, we're going to be showing you all six of these patches I have right here. Because so I got the extra patches right here. And there's one patch that I wanted to figure out a way to put on my other vest or 
or when you start another battle jacket at this point. So let's begin. So the first one I'm going to start off with, I had this patch, and this is an extra patch that I got right here, because I don't know why I got two patches as well. And I thought that was very impressive, and that's going to help you obviously start a new battle jacket, that's why, and that is Slipknot. I have another Slipknot patch. I do have my Slipknot patch, where it says people equals shit on it, but I have it on my vest, though, because I have a good proper way of how I wanted to come by, and this is going to help you start a brand new battle jacket, because I just... I have a feeling that I'm going to start a new battle jacket because I have a good proper way of this as well. And obviously I have wanted to come by. So yeah. Yeah, this is my extra patch I have right here. Even though I do have, but it's in, it's a different Slipknot patch. I don't know why I got two Slipknot patches on there. I mean, if you haven't seen my previous video that I did a while back, where I did my Metal Patches unboxing video, the link will be in the, in the description down below if you want to go check out my previous video that I did a while back as well. This is my extra Slipknot patch, and this is going to go into my different battle jacket once I plan to start a new one at this point, because this is just going to get to me as well. And of course, I got another patch I have right here, and even though I have my other one I have on my vest, and that is KISS, I got another KISS patch as well, because this is going to go into my other battle jacket, because why not? Because I have a feeling, though, is that I just wanted to start a brand new battle jacket, because I have a good, proper feeling, though, as well, because I just wanted to come by on this accordingly. So yeah, although I do have my other KISS patch, which is on the back of my battle jacket, but this is an extra one I got, and this is going to go onto my other battle jacket that I'm going to get once I start to get a, a denim vest with the pocket ones on there. That looks like my vest on there, but there's some pockets on the sleeve on there as well, if I could ever find one as well. Yeah, because I got another KISS patch, because why not? You know, I just wanted to come by for this as well, accordingly as well. So, that's how many down? That was two down, only four more patches to go as well. Another patch I got right here, and well, even though I have this one, and this is another one that I got, and I'm going to start another battle jacket at this point also, and that is... Slayer. I got another Slayer patch as well. Even though I do have my other Slayer patch, but it's on my other vest though, because I'm going to start a new battle jacket because I have this one right here, because I have a feeling though I'm going to start a, a good proper way whenever you want to come by on this accordingly. So yeah, because I have a feeling that I'm going to start a new battle jacket because I got another Slayer patch. Even though I got my other Slayer patch, which is on my vest on there. But this is the other Slayer patch, like this one I got right here. Because this is part of the 25 pieces of patches on there that I got on there from my previous unboxing video. Because I just wanted to come by for this accordingly. And yeah, this is all new to me though, because this is how I wanted to come by for this one as well. So, yeah. Three down. So, we're down to the other last three right here. You know, it's this one. Because we're down to the, the last three of these other patches I have right here as well. So, another patch I got right here. And, although I do have an, it on my other vest as well. Because I'm going to start a new battle jacket at this point. That I have a good proper thing as well. So yeah, yeah, because I just wanted to come by for this one, and that is Anthrax. I got another Anthrax patch I got right here, because why not? 
because I have the whole good proper thing for this as well because I have a feeling that I'm gonna have to you know put this on your your battle jacket because I'm gonna start a new one although I do have an anthrax patch which is on my vest though but it's in yellow but this is in white as well yeah it's more different than my previous one as well same goes with my slayer patch which is this but it's in white however my other slayer patches is on my battle jacket it's red and but this is different color on there yeah because I think I have it just like my anthrax patch as well yeah this is a lot more common because I got oh wow I got two slayer and anthrax patches I have well the other two are on my vest but these two I'm gonna start when I'm ever gonna get a new battle jacket that I start with as well because you know anthrax one of the greatest metal bands on there they're part of the big four along with Metallica Megadeth and Slayer because I just wanted to come by for those bands as well because I have a feeling though well anthrax started as a metal band because they're from New York as well unlike most Bay Area thrash bands like Metallica and Megadeth well Anthrax was the first thrash metal band that started it in New York. Same with Slayer. Slayer was the first thrash metal band started in Los Angeles as well. But, however, I just wanted to come by for thrash metal bands as well. Yeah, because Anthrax has put out these hits on these albums like Among the Living and most of the albums what Anthrax had a lot to do as well. Yeah, because however, this can be perfect for my another battle jacket as well. And of course, I got another patch I have right here and this is another one I got as well. And this is perfect to have this on your battle jacket as well. Because I'm going to start a new battle jacket at this point. Just like I did my first one I did a while back as well. I got another patch that I have right here. Venom. I got a, my another Venom patch. Even though I do have my other Venom patch, which is on my battle jacket, which is just says Venom on it. But this Venom patch has the pentagram on that one. Yeah, if you take notice on that. Yeah, it's Venom as well. Man, oh boy, I have another Venom patch because, to me, Venom is one of my favorite metal bands from the 80s on there because Venom has known for these albums they did, such as uh, Welcome to Hell, Black Metal, At War with Satan, Possessed, Calm Before the Storm album, and I think they all, you know, because those are the, the, the original albums that Venom did when they're formed by members like Kronos, Abaddon, and Mantis as well, because those are the original lineup for the band Venom. When Kronos left the, the band, Tony Dalton, who goes by the name Demolition Man, formed the band, joined Venom, and they did their album Primeval. Yeah, because I thought Primeval is a good album, though, because it's very unique for what, how, what, you know, it's just basically is the first, you know, Primeval was the first album from Venom to feature Demolition Man after Kronos left the band as well, until, you know, Tony Dalton, also known as Demolition Man, formed his other band called Venom Incorporated. Ever since Kronos return has went back to join the band Venom again, when Venom did their later albums, such as Metal Black, which is one of the later albums, what Venom did as well, because I just wanted to come by for those bands like this as well, because you know, cause I know there's I know some good songs by Venom, you know, Nightmare, Primeval. Welcome to Hell, Sons of Satan, Red Light Fever, um, In League with Satan, Welcome to Hell, um, 
One Thousand Days in so of Sodom. That's another er, song. Countess Bathory, Black Metal. Those are the songs from... And also Metal Black as well. Oh my god, that album is much more Satan. What, when, you know, especially for what Venom did as well. Because, you know, this has all has got to me for how, to my curiosity for what I come by for a band like Venom. Because to me, Venom is one of my favorite bands. Because I'm starting to like this band though, be, right next to other my favorites like Celtic Frost, Hellhammer, Merciful Fate, and uh, Bathory as well. Well, Bathory you have to be in the mood for because, you know, Bathory has went over to Viking Metal, but Venom just throw in any time because to me, Venom is one of my favorite bands uh, from the 80s as well because they had these primary influences from other bands like uh, Black Sabbath, Kiss, Sex Pistols, The Who, any other bands, what how Venom has these primarily, on even Motorhead, because that's what, that's just particularly for what, Venom had these musical influences as well, yeah, because despite of how they, because how, you know what, Kronos from Venom had, when he was barking out those lyrics, like, especially if you listen to the song, Welcome to Hell, and, or Thousand Days of Sodom. Yeah, because this is all how I wanted to come by for this as well, because to me, I love the band Venom, because, you know, I don't know why I have this one, because why not? I love Venom, because, you know, Venom is one of my favorite metal bands, in, in, my, in my opinion. Because I love me some old school metal from the 80s like Venom because they have these primarily how they makes how they were they well they were particularly are like the pioneers of black metal in during the 80s when they were formed in Newcastle England as well and at last I got another patch as well and this is particularly by far one of my favorite occult metal, doom metal bands that I have been primarily listened as well. And I got right here, which is for my battle jacket as well. That is Ghost. You know, Ghost is formed by Tobias Forge because, you know, Tobias Forge just goes by character names when, when he formed the band Ghost on there, like during the, the whole cycle like, you know, when they did their first album, Opus Eponymous, in 2010's decade. You know, when Ghost performed live in 2011, you know, he goes by the character Papa Emeritus One, And as, well, his other members that play the, the, the rhythm and lead guitars and the bass guitar and the, the keyboards and the drum, they go by the nameless ghouls as well. When they did their album, Infestissumum, Tobias Forge goes by Papa Emeritus 2. When they did the album, Meliora, Papa Emeritus 3. And then when they did until the, the cycle with Pope Star EP and including those live tracks on there. And then when 2018 comes, it goes by Cardinal Copia in the prequel cycle. And now when he goes by Papa Emeritus 4, it, it's the Empera cycle as well. Because, you know, Ghost had m many of those albums, you know, like Perquel, Opus Eponymous, Infestissumum, Meliora. And they had their EP on there, like the 7 Inches of Satanic Panic Al EP on here, which it has the song Mary on a Cross which is how that was that was one of the songs from Ghost that how they used it as like a TikTok m meme on there video meme or whatever they use as well yeah it, it's just basically how when they were using it as well I could imagine if they use that song in uh, Hell of a Boss 
what we can only imagine, though, as well. But overall, this is... I had to get this one, because this is part... I used to have this one, but I think I lost it whenever I returned some manga that I borrowed from the library, because I think I accidentally used it as a bookmark as well. But then, well, I lost it, though, but no need to worry. I got this as a replacement, though, because... I don't know why, because... I just thought it was very impressive, though, because this is a good... Re yeah, this is a good proper way of a replacement, though. Yeah, things come all in one. Well, it just basically all comes in surprises as well. Well, according to most patches that have pentagrams on it, like my Venom patch I have right here, I think it's just also the same in the same way how... Like, you see those title cards for, like, American web series, like, from Viv C-Pop, who is the creator of has -Been Hotel, which is a hell of a boss. They used this pentagram in the title. I mean, how do they do that as well? Well, just because of those dark... Because they use it, like, a little darker in that. And it just captures the imagination, though. Well, you had metal bands on there for these patches on there because that I might find. Well, you have Bathory, you had Celtic Frost, you had Hellhammer, you had Burzum, Dark Funeral, and all these other metal band patches because I want to look for those patches because I have a proper way to start a new battle jacket as well. The way I've come by for this, you know, the vest on there as well because this is all new to me, that's why. So, that's going to be it for my brand new patch update video for today, you guys. Thank you for watching. Click on the subscribe button. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, especially if you're new to my channel. Oh, click on the notifications bell button. Be sure to get notified also as well for more latest updates once you subscribe to my channel by clicking on the subscribe button, especially if you're new to my channel as a newcomer. Smack the, the like button if you enjoyed the video. Let me know your thoughts in the comments by leaving your comments right in the comments section below as you... Just let me know if you like as well. Is there any comments on there? Just let me know as well. Like any ideas or any thoughts on there? Just let me know by leaving your comments right in the comments section below. If you like as well. And also, be sure to check out my Anime Planet or Analyst at your leisure. Because I've been literally getting into Letterboxd as well. I have a feeling that I'm going to start getting into Letterboxd. That's why. And I'm also getting into uh, starting a new battle jacket because I have I'm gonna have more patches on my other battle jacket because I have a feeling as well. Even though I have six of these patches total, I have a feeling I'm gonna have a the whole devoting to starting a new battle jacket. Because I always plan to start a new one at this point as well. Yeah. it's It wasn't that easy, though, if you ever starting a new battle jacket. That's a good proper way. That's why. So, yeah. Yeah, it's okay if you can start a new battle jacket, though. Like, just like I did where I started my battle jacket in since the summer back in July because I have been low on ideas and I thought of starting a battle jacket as well because this is going to help me devote it almost exclusively with whenever I've started going to metal concerts that's why because I've been literally getting into going to concerts that's why because why not because especially if I can go to a mosh pit like if you ever go to a metal concert I've been literally getting into the mosh pits that's why whenever I can go see my favorite metal band live and concert, that's why. I can listen to metal at home if I want to, If I, especially if you listen to on the albums, especially on either CD or vinyl, that's why. In case you're wondering. And, yeah, I'm all... I guess I could form a metal band at this point, whenever I can start the gig as well. If I can find band members, that's why. And that's all I have to say for this video. This is 
Ruroni K95 saying thank you for watching my video and I'm glad you liked it. I hope you enjoy it. Hope to see you soon for the next video. Be sure to stay safe and stay healthy and have a great day. And horns up for this one. Because I'm going to start a battle jacket at this point because I got six of these so I can start a new battle jacket at one point. This is Ruroni K95 saying thank you for watching my video and I'm glad you liked it. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope to see you soon for the next video. Stay safe, stay healthy. Hope you all have a great day. This is Ruroni K95 signing off. Thank you for watching my video. And I'll see you soon for more videos that I got on plan for what's in store. Take care. Ta-ta for now for this patch update video. Bye.